First at five, attorneys for a man shot by an Orange County deputy expect to take legal action. They claim the shooting was not justified. In an afternoon news conference, the attorneys said Cedric Barty is out of the hospital but has a lengthy recovery ahead. The 28 year old was shot when confronted in a parking lot, sitting in a car reported stolen. The deputy who fired indicated Barty was moving inside the car and that he did not surrender. West News Dave McDaniels live at the Orange County Sheriff's Office, where the sheriff himself is asking for patience from the community. Dave. Well, Red, I did speak with Sheriff Jerry Debbings this afternoon, and he told me he was not surprised to hear about the possibility of legal action being taken in this case, but he also wanted to remind everyone that the Florida Department of Investigation is taking a look at all of this, and that investigation is far from over. Surgeons removed the bullet and multiple bullet fragments from his chest and right lung. Attorneys for 28 year old Cedric Barty says he's out of the hospital but faces a lengthy recovery. Limited use of his arm, we're told breathing is painful. Barty was shot by Sergeant Robert McCarthy when Barty and another man were found in a parking lot in a car reported stolen. Initial report said the deputy saw movement after giving orders to surrender, so he fired. The attorneys say so far, their investigation disputes that claim. He continuously maintained his hands in a visibly raised position. He made no furtive or threatening movements to the officer. We believe that Deputy McCarthy's actions constitute an unjustified use of excessive force by a police officer. How can you make a decision at this point if you don't have all the facts? Orange County Sheriff says the Florida Department of Law Enforcement is investigating, and he says that packet will go to the state attorney for review once completed. He says accountability is important. But stresses patience. Our citizens have been patient. Uh, they are watching and monitoring the process, and that's a good thing for all of us. The agent in charge with the FDLE says we're going to conduct a thorough review of all facts and evidence, including scene reconstruction, before submitting an FDLE report to the state attorney for review. And while the Florida Department of Law Enforcement continues its investigation, Sergeant McCarthy has been reassigned, and he'll stay on that reassignment until that investigation is completed and submitted to the state attorney. Sheriff Deming says that accountability is extremely important, but he also believes his agency has the proper policies and training in place. Reporting live in Orange County, Dave McDaniel, West 2 News.